um, when Lambe came, I was, I guess, just a scientist, never had a chance to really uh, got to see him or anything like that. Not long after he arrived, one day he called me to his office. Okay, and uh, then when I, when I got in, then he said that uh, there was a problem today. Your son, Victor, Victor was about 10 years old at the time, okay, uh, brought a fake gun to school, but he brought a real bullet to the international school. And the principal, I think, uh, was not very happy about it. And I guess reported it to the director of administration, and the director of administration reported to him. So he had to call me, right? So I said, oh my God, I mean, you know, how on earth could that happen? And I was a bit concerned. I said, why could Victor bring a real bullet? Where did he get it from? In my mind. Then I was uh, a bit concerned, but then Lampe immediately said, he said, you know, any boy at his age, could do something like that. It's normal, don't worry, and things like that. So I said, uh, oh, okay. I mean, I, didn't, I hadn't talked to him before. I didn't know him or anything like that. So I said, oh, okay, thank you, and then I left. Two days later, he called me again to his office, and I said to myself, oh, what did Victor do this time, okay? <laughs> but I was wrong. He has nothing to do with Victor. He said, um, Iri was asked to do strategic planning. It was the first time Iri was supposed to do strategic planning. And he needed somebody to organize a group to be able to, to work on the strategic plan. And he would like for me to do it. And I said, maybe those two days he dig out about who I was and what I was doing after I saw him about Victor. I don't know, okay? But I didn't know uh, from head to tail why he would ask that. So, of course, I said, oh, let me think about it, you know, because he said this would really take a lot of your time. You might not have time to do statistics. Now, at that time, I thought, oh, yeah, he wanted me to get out of statistics. So he wanted to find a place for me somewhere. But then uh, maybe because he saw me the other day and uh, he went back and looked and said, maybe this is a good something. I don't know. I couldn't guess what it was. But uh, I thought long and hard about it, and I went back uh, a couple of days later and uh, told him that, uh, okay, I would agree to do that, as long as I still can uh, be in, in department statistics. But I didn't think I could, uh, I know that I could do both. I mean, what is this? You hold meetings, you, you talk to people, it shouldn't take the whole day. And so he said, sure, sure, sure. Of course, not many years later, he changed his mind. But uh, anyway, by then I knew him very well already. So I must say that uh, then we became close co-workers, I guess, as many people know that I work very closely. Probably the first DG that I ever worked with that closely. So I said, at least Victor was the, maybe was uh, responsible for bringing us together. 